Jordanian, but I just sort of grew up my whole life here. I was raised here, I did all my schooling here, and obviously this is the place where I played all my golf growing up, up until now. So it's always been like my home. Everything I've sort of ever done was here in Dubai. So when I was younger, about four years old, I had this old uh, gaming console, it's called the Wii. It had a variety of different sports on it, one of them being golf. So, I don't know, I was always attached to uh, golfing on there. So my dad noticed that and decided, why don't we pick it up outside and see where it goes. And I was always attached to it. You know, I love golf since I was really, really young. So just sort of stuck to it. Some of my most memorable ones include the ones where I broke course records. Those are obviously the ones that you think about the longest. They stay, stay in your memory for a while. One of them being JA Amateur, which I broke the course record there, and it's my home course where I do my coaching, so it's pretty, it's pretty cool to have that there. I still think about it to now, even though it was a little bit ago. So under the World Amateur Golf Ranking, I'm ranked 402nd as an amateur. In the juniors, I'm ranked top 60. Coming up next week, I've got the Asian Games in China, which is quite a big event this year. And end of October is the Asia Pacific Amateur in uh, Australia. We're going to be playing in Royal Melbourne, which is a very world-renowned golf course. So that's super exciting, having a chance to compete in that high level of competition as well. And then hopefully a professional start later on in the year. It's always good to represent your country, to be representing them in these big events coming up. It's pretty cool. You have your own sort of team and you have that team factor as well. The biggest thing for me, the main goal that I really want to get to is to just be the, the best player in the world. Everything that sort of happens along the way should just happen on its own, but that's, that's kind of where I want to get to at the end.